Hello and welcome to the latest episode of the Board Masters with me, Chris Mullins, and joined once again by Alex and Stacey as we go into scenario seven of Quora Quest. And Stacey's turn to do a bit of flavour text because you haven't got to do any yet this uh, this series. I didn't think it was number seven. We got four more episodes to go of this little stories. Yeah, although I know they've done an extra free one online that I can download. Mm. So okay. that means five. Mm. So we've got today a little bit of tap dancing. So it's a beautiful hot day in Hoserfield. Um, you are out for a walk. You pass by the entrance of the dungeon and you see Kevin and Annabelle standing there. And Annabelle looks cross while well, Kevin looks guilty. Mm. We were filling up water balloons in the dungeon ready to have a water fight. And Kevin turned all the taps on so tightly that we can't turn them off. Annabelle tells you. And now the dungeon is filling up with water. If you don't turn them off, it's going to flood the dungeon and then the town. And then the fish will have a nice home. <laughs> <laughs> it's not my fault that the taps are so stiff, says Kevin grumpily. I'm just not strong enough to turn them off. Can you do it for us? I mm. want to say something. If the tap will flood the dungeon, then the entire city, then the entire world. My world. You agree and start climbing down into the dungeon. There are barrels. No, that's it. That's oh, we are about to jump onto yeah. the next bit. Right, so what characters have we got? I am Dwarf. Dwarf with your axe. I have got Crossbow Dude and Spear Woman. And I have that's you. the Wizard Woman. Yes, we picked these ones, especially Emily, because this is a much, a very different quest than the ones we've had before, because it's time sensitive, isn't it? We've only, if this gets off the bottom, we lose. Mm. And we drown. We drown, because mm. that's the dungeon flooding. Wait, what happens with the ending if we lose? It's just, it was too hard for you to turn off the taps. You drown and the entire city was flooded. Yeah, that's pretty much what will happen. I imagine um, if that was actually the text and I just guessed. <laughs> that would be a good guess. And we, we failed on our first attempt. Well, technically we didn't. We didn't last long enough to fail. We had our first rage quit. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so. The, I rage quit really easily. Well, that was the first time you had, but it, we've won really well up to now, haven't we? Uh, so we picked characters that we hope will be a bit more suitable for the journey ahead. Why did they change Dwarf again? Because he's got a very strong power that he can move and attack at the same time. Yeah. So there is a plunger in this game to stop the taps. And we choose Spear Woman for the taps because her ability is to choose as if she can do a success on any dice roll. So even if she gets a miss, she can use her yeah. ability to just get a success and do it immediately. So let's hope mm -hmm. Spear Woman gets the plunger and is able to use it. Who's going first then? But if she doesn't, then someone will have to pass it over. Yeah. I think Spear Woman should go first because we need to do lots of exploring in this one, don't we? And she's on a corner, so she can explore two directions straight away. Well, so is Crossbow Dude. And so can Crossbow Dude. True. Uh, I can do either one, whichever one you want. You choose. I'll go with Spear Woman. I was thinking Crossbow Dude a little <laughs> bit, but I'm not sure. Mm. Also, the first time we played, we just had like all the alts out immediately. Yeah, so we got to be a bit more careful this time. So we've it's got an orc and a goblin. It's because we were doing it like crazy. And we were just not thinking that there were going to be so many orcs out. True. I'm going to attack this, trying to win. this goblin straight away. Yeah, I was going to say I want to attack mm. the orc. I'm going to use my power and kill it. Because it's going to be a little while before we get the plunger, I think. Yeah. It's going to take like about... Explore five. again. It's going to take yeah. about... I think I will explore again and rely on the dwarf and crossbow dude. Well, that's two orcs. Two orcs. So I've still got another action. Chocolate. So I am going to attack the orc that is next to wizard woman. No. So spear woman is determined. So who's going next? I think the dwarf could do some, try and do some damage on this orc. 
What do you think, Alex? In charge. One damage. Mm -hmm. And dead. dead. Nice. Well done, Mr. Dwarf. Uh, do you want me to do some more exploring with Crossbow Dude? Or do you, Wizard Woman, do you want to see if you can do something on that orc? On the two orcs, yeah. Well, I think you're going to do the one at the minute. Unless you... Unless I damage him and do the same amount of damage. That's only to adjacent, adjacent. ones though, isn't it? And they're diagonal, no, sadly. Adjacent. But maybe next turn if you're still alive. So that's one. one. Only one, sadly. Only one. You're determined. You yeah. are determined. Wait, what's your power? To do the same damage to another target, but they have to be standing next to each other. Okay, what's mm. crossbow dude's power? Well, I can attack three times if I don't move. Oh, yeah. So I could explore with crossbow dude. Because crossbow no. dude can't attack from where he is. No. But I don't want you to explore because there could be another two orcs in the room. There could be. There but... could be, but we, we're against the clock, aren't we? True. Mm -hmm. And Fine. let's try it. Oh my gosh! I called it. You did. So we've got two orcs and a gremlin. Maybe you should have listened to me. Maybe. I'm going to attack this gremlin. He's dead. Oh I'll attack. I thought you said goblin for a minute. The but, um, orc at the back. Power. No. Power. I'm going to use my power now and attack him again. Oh, just the one. So I'm not determined anymore. At one point I thought you were going to get none and then you get double determined. Yeah. And now it's the orc's turn. So that orc at the front, he's attacking... You. Yeah, you can go with that he one. He's going two reds. Thank you. Two reds. Oh, Ooh, maybe two I damage. shouldn't have done that because maybe... Yeah, you could have had him attack the dwarf. Because yeah. uh, now this one's going to move and attack me as well. One. Okay. I don't have that good rolls this time. The one that I rage quitted, I got a, a, a lot more better rolls. Because one time, I just got them like that. You did. It was right. very good. Like three times so in a row. This orc is going to attack Wizard Woman. And which one is this going to attack? Probably, what, probably spear one. Right, yeah. yeah. But you need to do You're that. about to say skull girl. You need to do wizard in the first place. Yeah, Tell I'm not you. that good at rolling. And another attack. You do it. I'm not doing good. One. And then That's this three. one's gonna attack and yes, we'll have that one attack spear woman. So You're better one. at rolling than me. And that's the end of that round. We've already taken so much damage. We have taken a lot of damage, but Stace now has two adjacent enemies stood next to each other, so she could use her power while oh, wait, she's determined. I just, I just noticed something. Look. Yeah. Like they're guarding us, and the only enemy is to go forwards. It just goes one on each. One on each. If there was an orc, okay. if there were two orcs there and we had six orc standees, then that means we would have like we the surround thing us left, right, and centre. We can't do anything. <laughs> two. It was whether I kill that kill one. Kill that one. Yeah. Because then there's only leaves one. Lol. Should have saved your power for that turn, shouldn't we? Uh. Are we meant uh, to know? We're meant no, to say I know. It's a, it's a risk. First, aren't we? Okay. Risky. So. Well, sword girl could open up here, kill him. I can't hear anything. Yeah, sword. Uh, sword it's spear spear woman. woman. So you've got that in my head now. <laughs> you're call, it's like you're just calling uh, hero cat nightmare cat, but Nine, now you're yeah. calling spear woman sword girl. So okay. I'm going to then move. Yes. I can't I do the chest, but I'm going to open up. Orc. It's story. story. Yay. So we need some flavour text. What? So, there are barrels full of dirty washing and sacks full of soap powder in this area. This must be where the monsters in the dungeon do their laundry. There is a tap which is turned on and splashing water all over the floor. 
There is a drain under the tap which should be taking all the water away, but unfortunately it is blocked. Oh dear. When you take a look at the drain, you discover it's blocked with some mouldy old gremlin socks and dirty goblin underpants. I have something so, to say, they should do better washing. Better laundry. <laughs> yeah. At least the orcs haven't blocked it up. Yeah, the orcs are good. These guys are good laundries. But it would be help if they had a washing machine. Yeah. There is no way you are going to use your hands to clear that blockage. It is far too disgusting. Wait, I want to give a clue. You are going to need a special <laughs> tool for that. Yes, I let's already gave away the spoiler for that one. Mm. We know full well what the... Uh... We need to go and get a special tool, so we need to keep going. It's a okay. point. So, crossbow dude and the dwarf. Uh, have crossbow dude attack the damaged orc in front of him. He's oh, dead. I thought he was going to survive. Aww. And then attack the other one. One. So that's one damage. Should I explore? Leave it there in a minute. No, I think you need to come and kill this orc. I'm gonna use Can you explore power. or are you gonna explore, honey? No, because I'm diagonal, so I can't. I'm gonna use my power. Right. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna attack one full action. Why isn't the orc standing on it? That's only because Well, because we knew reach. you were gonna attack it. And... Okay, move and attack. One. one. And then another attack. He did. Okay. See, if I didn't use my power, I wouldn't have defeated the orc. No, that's why his power is so good. Right. So, Next end go. of the round. Next go. So, shall I have Spearwoman open the chest? You can do if it's going to be Or shall any... we go exploring first? I would say go exploring, but there could be a health potion. There could. That's true. Uh, okay, I'll have Spearwoman open the chest. What is it? Oh, it's the Amulet of Nimbleness. Of Nimbleness? You automatically seize any dice rolls before one's in track. Oh, well, that's handy, so she, she'll be very that. good for opening yeah, chests so then. so low health. See, that you're already at five, and yeah, you started at eight. But that's crossbow dude, that's alright. I took no damage. They're just too scared to beat me. Mm -hmm. And my mighty axe. Oh, I'll go there and then I will explore. And we've got a corridor, which isn't a bad thing. And then I can explore again because I'm on the edge. And we've got another story. We've got I. Holy. Wait, I just noticed something. And this is a big bonus because Spear Woman was the one who explored. Yeah, I have something else to say. If you turn your head, if we had something like that, it would look like the Teen Titans building. <laughs> Like a tea. <laughs> That's the very random observation, but yes, let's have some flavour text. This is the area where the monsters keep all their tools. However, monsters don't have much of an interest in DIY, so there's not much in here except an old chest, a plunger and a tap, which is currently pouring out water all over the floor. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the hero who uncovers card I takes the plunger and yeah. a special item deck. Hero standing on card I can try to turn off the tap. As soon as the tap is turned off, two spiders climb up the water pipe and into this room. Where? Place two spider tokens on any two different empty squares on card I. Oh, okay. Wait, so when we what? unblock the drain, two spiders come in. I didn't hear no, that. No, as soon well. as the, spider, uh, the tap is turned off, this is not the one that's blocked remember this is just a tap oh okay so we don't need the plunger on this one no you just need to turn the tap off okay oh well i get so it's oh never mind i thought the drain would make a difference but it it's not no the drain's working in this one isn't it okay but you need to have but the hero standing on it idea. what if down there the spiders are having like a bath but when we turn it off the like having a shower that like this the water stops and they're like and they come up from the drain and they're like hey yeah, we were like having a shower incy wincy spider coming up the once the rain stopped they're climbing up the they're spout or yeah. up the drain they're they're climbing up the sh they're climbing up the dungeon drain what are you thinking stace you look like you're strategizing over there well i didn't know if you wanted me to open up any well i could give me four and then open up over here yeah you can do one, oh, I, two, wait, three. I got alliteration in a song I've made. The Incy 
the in see evil spider climbed up the dungeon <laughs> the, drain. the dungeon drain and then it got killed by heroes and was <laughs> never seen again nice that is very creative on the off chance okay. i was trying to rhyme there as well so you've still got try. another action haven't you yeah and you've got range you can hit that one I yeah, think. I, I think she one. can hit either one because she's got a range of three. Both! Yeah, one, two. Mm. Ah, determined. You're determined. That's not a bad thing though because they may be next to each other next go. I could have crossbow do shoot at them. Shh, I see you can shoot both. Mm -hmm. Yeah, should I do that then? Yes. So I'll shoot at this one first. One. Determined. Determined, and I can use my power. Everybody's getting determined. Two. Two. Yeah. I'm not determined anymore. Well, if before you had that go, Stacy was determined. You were determined, and so was Spear Woman. Yeah. So I was the only one who was not determined, and, I, and everybody was like angry, and I was like, "What is going on? Are we going to wait?" Spear woman to do the tap, so has she got her ability to do it? Yeah, Change. yeah, uh, spear woman can use her ability yeah, potentially, she's the only one though. and then she can probably handle killing two spiders because they're only one point of damage, mm -hmm. and then she can go off back with the plunger and do that one. So, shall we get the dwarf to go? Yeah, it's just the way everybody else is going then and keep on opening up. We're lucky because mm -hmm. they're basically like right next to each other except this one block. Yeah, so we might want to go like this way in a minute just to, to try and get the other story one close as well. And then it could get like maybe here. Maybe. Just uh, but right, since we Mr. have Dwarf, so much more cards. You're the only one left to go this turn. What are you planning? You hurt me. Well, that's not true. <laughs> I, I have four health, so I, don't, I might as well. Okay, so you're going to attack this one, see if we can kill off another orc. I killed him. Nice. That's the end of the round. And also, now she won't, he won't go after the wizard woman, he will go after me since it's only one block instead of two. True, so let's do that then. Let's have him go after you. Since so I am a shot bolt here. And two reds, and you're on full health. Only one damage. Nice. Strategy. <laughs> right, so next round, what should we start with? Did, uh, I was about oh, to yeah. say, did you take my red? Do the powers. It's going down. It is going down. But... Right, you need to do this spear woman, please. Do spear woman on here. I was thinking to go there so you could so get I, an What egg. do I roll? You have to roll a red, but if you're just going to have a success, if you yeah, don't you... get one. Yeah, but I'll write, I can roll do that Roll one afterwards. red die for that hero, plus one white die yeah, for just... any hero I'm... who's also standing on the card. I was thinking I only... I was going to go out there, so I got an extra white, but I was like, hang on, it's Spear Woman. Fine. Yeah. Got the success, so I don't need to waste my power. So That's it goes done. up to. And we need... need two it spiders. goes up to. It goes yep, up to. It goes up to. Right, so there's no point in going to do the other one this turn. No, two spiders. Wait, does the plunger so count she... as an action or a free action? Uh, a free action, I think. Check the rules. Does it say no, it just says it? take whoever uncovers, take the plunger card. And then it, does it say... And then as a hero standing on card, I can turn off the tap. Okay, so it doesn't so say an action. It doesn't say so that fine. it is an action. But what if it does say it in the log? Well, that's fine. We'll sort it out. Well, later. don't worry it's not about gonna, that. It's not going to damage the game that much. I've still got one more action, so I'm going to attack this spider right next to me. And you still have your power. Yeah, I'm going to save that potentially for next turn for the other spider. Nope, so spear. Oh, spear woman is determined, so I can. No. No, no, no. <laughs> She's still determined. Uh, She's. Wait, is she triple determined? Pretty much. She's triple determined. I mean, Crossbow Dude's got line of sight on both of those anyway. How? Wait, how did he see that one? Well, he only he'll only get line of sight on that one if I kill that one. Oh. So he doesn't have line of sight on that one now, technically. Yeah. Well, there we go. That one's dead. I'll take that roll. <laughs> yeah, you're. 
you'll take it because then you'll just then you could just get a zero. Then this then the all. And did I not even We haven't had a go. No. No, you no. Are, you and you and Stace have still got your actions. One, nice. Yeah. Dead. Do you want to explore? You explore, Ryan. Let's maybe do just one card. Could be all stuff. Yeah. We'll could be. Could be, but, but. No. We need to open up, though, baby. But I don't want to. Okay. Well, maybe Stace will then. Because there's no spiders and it's on five. Fine, I'll do it. It's just easier if you do but it. But I'm warning you. <laughs> just a chest. Just a chest. Perfect. See, that was nice. But it's just a dead end. Well, that's a good thing, because we don't want to go that way anyway. Should I go there and open it up? Yeah, probably a good idea. Fine. Okay, I want to see... So, remember earlier when I said it could be a potion of healing? It's a potion of healing. Nice. Four damage, if you use it. No, no Four no, health. Because I can't go up to eight. Can't go past eight, so it might yeah. be worth saving until you drop to four. And that's, it. that's the end of the round. Or so spider. So the spider. Yeah. Spider's going to move one. It's one, doesn't it? Wait, how? I think it, no, it can move up to five. Yeah, spiders. but that's fine. It's just going to move one because he's going to attack spear when we one hit. That's not bad. Next round. This comes down. We've all got our powers back. Move to where you get the plunger. Yeah, you think I should? We need to do that first. So I'll just run straight over here. And do it! It's just one red die, isn't it? Yeah. I'll use my power. Make it a success. So that one goes up to... A! Hey. And this one's... We need a token. Do spiders come up this one as well? I don't think so. Because it looks the same. It looks the same. Funny. I'm just having a little nosy while you were sorting that out. That was a bit weird. Well, it looks. This doesn't this the one. Oh, it only goes up one space. For that one. Right. Okay, Daniel. Ah. Oh. Um. So I've still got another action, haven't I? I say you should come back then. One, two, three, four. Should I explore? Yeah, it's probably a good idea. Yeah, whenever a tap is turned off, one. moves a threat. Token up two. Well, see at the bottom there says just one. Yeah. Move the threat token up one space because that one isn't. A... That's a bit silly, isn't it? Maybe that uh, people who. Well, I think C because we're just turning off the tap. We probably could have done that first. We probably didn't need the plunger for that one. I'm not sure. Oh, no. no, the plunger is C. I was just turn off the tap. Okay. Is what I need. So maybe it's turn off the taps of two and just the plunger one was one. But I didn't. Okay. Well, maybe. we're in the right position anyway. So not me. And, not my go. I just did it. Oh, did you miss, the, miss them? Yes. Okay. So I can have crossbow, dude. Yeah, I can see that gremlin and I've got range on him. He's dead. I'm trying to get a hit on the goblin. No. No, uh, I'm in the way, I think. I'll shoot this spider then. Shoot the spider. Yeah, spider's dead as well. I remember in a, like, a little meme where someone just had like a dart and there was a spider like on the ceiling and then he just threw the dart at the spider and killed it. Oh, that's cruel. I know, it's weird. Uh, so just you to go, wizard woman. It's your go. I say you should try and attack that these two. Four, three. Well, I can only attack one. Because we have five goes. Yeah. So you should attack the... As you're determined, it might be a good idea to well, go for the goblin. Well, yeah. you can't, you have to move have one to move. space to hit him. Yes. Mm -hmm. So I would say just go there, since the goblin will hit me. And I have nine health, so that's more than you at nice. least. Okay, so you're not determined anymore. So it's now goblin. Yeah. 
then you have two whites. Two whites for the goblin. Okay, can you pass a white? Thanks. See? Nice. Yeah. Two. Oops. Just two damage. And then the gremlin attacks with just one red. Just one red. So you can do... Wait, he has to move. Oh, he wait. can see wizard woman. And technically he can see you as well. Two one wizard woman? Yeah. But then I'll use that. Okay, so you go first. And then go up. What? So that this, this is part of your turn then. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, but using is a free action. Yeah, so it doesn't cost an action, but it's part of your turn. Right, so if you sorted out that, so we started again. Yeah. Okay. Right, so I, need so I would say I should go and attack. No, I well, Stace has already started her turn because oh, she used yes. her potion. So. I forgot. So. Well, you've got line of sight and range on both. But I only have one range. Right. So you want me to try? I don't know. Oh, they're I not next to each other, to are they? No. Never mind. <gasps> Never mind. Get that gremlin. One. Nice. The gremlin's dead. And then see if you can kill the goblin as well. And so is the goblin. Alright, Alex. I think you can... Explore. Move, explore and open that chest if you want. Okay. I already have the torch anyway. Yeah, we're hey, not very good at putting I, that back. Who guesses then. it's a story? No. No. Just a plain chest room. Where we could put it? Put it yeah. there. Yeah. Okay. We like a chest room now. Right, but you can open right, one so of those chests. Which one are you chests. opening? Um, I'll take this one. Since that one? Stacy can go over here and open that one. Okay. It's X-ray goggles. Oh. Okay. Well, I'll have crossbow dude. Come over. One, two, three, four, and use my second action to take that. Yeah. And then I'll have Spear Woman go here and open this one. Ooh, I'm lucky. This will be a Oh my gosh, we've never got this before. I mean, I don't, I've never known this in a game, but it's a potion healing which heals up to six health. Crikey. Ooh. Well, Spear Woman I, can I take some damage then. I almost just fell over. <laughs> well, that wouldn't have been good. Would but it? if when I just saw it, I just leaned back a tiny bit. Yeah. That, All right. Yeah, everybody done. Next round. Let's move the threat down a bit. Oh, we're on the bottom board. Ah! Spear woman's got her power back. I need to open up. Mhm. Mm should I get? Uh, maybe spear woman spear should woman. go. Just yeah. in case it's a story. Yeah, just in case, because since she's right there. And she's got that super strong potion. Oh, never mind. It's not a story. Well, we could link up again. Yeah. That's the thing. I'll move down there then. You can explore again. Yeah, because I was on the edge, wasn't I? It is a story. You're welcome. <laughs> Good idea, right? So we need some flavour text there, Stace. Then you walk in and fall into the bath. There is a very full bath. It's the little mystic sword. The magic sword. That we did in the other video last week. Mm. I think. With the yeah, turtle. Okay. With the tortoise footprints. Yeah. All right. Okay, you ready? Oh, yeah. The, oh, the bath's <laughs> done that. The bath's done <laughs> it kind of, Let's go through her flavour text, you sweetheart. I guess. I was just looking for the tap and then noticed, oh wait, it's the bath. <laughs> <laughs> then the toy duck will go flying everywhere. Let's go. Zip. Right, you see a grubby bathtub with a big hairy creature sitting in it. The creature is sitting, uh, scrubbing his, its feet with a bit of rag tied to a stick and is singing loudly and out of tune. Oh, it's not a toy, never mind. Both of the bath taps are turned on and the water is spilling out all over the floor. Oi, do you mind? I'm having a bath here. <laughs> the creature shouts angrily and throws its rubber duck at you. Oh. The creature leaps out of the bath, wraps a towel around its waist, then slips on a bar of soap on the floor and falls over backwards into the bath with a huge splash. Blow my neck, it mutters <laughs> angrily as it gets out of the bath again. 
You are gonna get a right walloping for this. I just, I'm just, I'm just thinking about where he just gets out of the tower and is just butt showing, and then he just gets the tower around. Well, you can't see much of his butt. He's all covered in hair. Yeah. So where do we put him? Just Any anywhere. Anywhere. No, he's, just... go he's going over here then. This is his footprints. Yeah. His it just says footprint. on an empty square. That's, That's fine because I've got no more actions with Spear Woman this turn, so she is gonna stay away. Should I try and like go over here and reroute? Yeah, we. I think that's a good idea. So, do. So the only thing is with Thunderman Scruffins, only hits made within a range of one can damage him. Yeah, so Dwarf is going to be really important against him. Because anyway... How do we stop the, the attack I and things? I my shield. As normal. I dropped my shield. A hero so... standing on card J can try and turn off the tap. Okay, so so I don't... We don't need to beat him to do that. No. So he just... So you can just turn off the tap and leave... And things like okay. But he is going to be following us, isn't he? He yeah. has got a movement of four, but yeah, it might be actually then worth me just trying to do that and then running away. Just do, yeah, true. I would say, I, should I try and reroute then to you? Maybe not, maybe start a new route. Start this way. Yeah, yeah. open your chest while you're there, unless you want Stace to do it. Stace! Okay. Why is... Isn't he closer to opening the chest? Well, he can open the chest from where he is, so yeah. it may be. Open the chest, move, and explore. Oh, yay, I got Warhammer. Upgrade. Oh, well, that worked out quite nicely, huh? Upgrade. Right. right. Move. Oh, I get two white dice. You get three whites and a red to Oh, my move. God. Because you're determined. Right, let's move you in a little bit. There we go. Right. Move. Now you can move and explore. Should I move over this way? Yeah, yes. just move forward. One, two... Well, I was going to say move forward on that one and you can open up that one and I can open this one in a second. Okay. Good yeah. shout. Well, I... That's a good thing. We don't yeah. mind that. Right, well, can't I can't do... move anymore. No. Right? no. That's fine. That's I'm fine. just sort of standing in the um, way. Because corridors are our friend in this one, I think. Yay. Right, so a goblin and an orc. If only that orc was on like one of like this one, this one, this one, and this one, and I want the orc to be there, so then it, I could come well, around and. Go you there. have line mm. of sight for that. Crossbow dude does, yeah. On what one, goblin? I Both. Could, I could tell you're not talking to me. And I've got range because I've got my crossbow. I've got range of seven, and I've got the X-ray goggles anyway. But you, you've got range on the goblin. Go for the goblin. She has range on both actually, since she has a range That's three. Well, he's, I've got three. Wait, you should mm. attack the orc. You should attack the I don't orc think we can go back and change <laughs> who we declared. No, Dang we it. did goblins. Though. We said the goblin. Let's go with the goblin. And I can have crossbow dude attack the orc. One. Two. Mm. Power. That would, it would have helped if, oh yeah, power. Three. Okay. Orc is dead. Orc is dead or dead. Right, Thunder McScruggins is going to come here and um, attack with four, four white dice. White oh. Oh, <laughs> One. <laughs> Happy with that. Wait, am I sure? he just scratched four times yeah. and he, needs to go in he and went scratch, off. scratch, scratch, scratch. One red one. No. Missed, so use my power. Use your power and run away. So let's turn that off so that goes back up two. Run! And no. then run away. One, two, three, four. Oh, we need to put a little token on that so that that one is. Did you have to move into the room? Yeah. Okay, so you, you can't have move. To, you Yeah, have so he's going to be. You have to be. Close behind me all the time, but I've got my potion, potion of six and it can't do more than four, so I'm alright at the minute. You have to be in the same room as the tap to turn it off. Yeah. Because you can't just stand there and Go just... Go to the corner, Stace, and then you can explore both ways, can't you? You can't just stand in another room and just try and reach out to do it. Just thinking of how you can... Yeah, is there a way you can orient it so crossbow dude's got line of sight? Yeah, that way? I don't... Uh, no, because there's a wall there. I think he could hit that the... way. I 
I can hit that gremlin and that orc. But you can't hit the other gremlin. No. But hopefully, wizard woman can maybe take out both gremlins. Do you want me to open up the other one? or? No, I don't think there's any rush. Right, so just get behind attack. me. I think you should attack. Right. Never mind. Okay. Well, this might be a good time to use your power next time. Mm. Right, crossbow dude. I don't have my power, so I need one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so I've got range on both. Let's go for the gremlin. That would be better on yours. I know, but the gremlin it's easier to gets two attacks, whereas the, the orc will only get one because he'll have to move. So that's one on the orc. That's one on the orc, orc. And the other gremlin can attack Wizard Woman where she was. Yeah, the other gremlin's gonna get two attacks, but it's your go, Alex. I'm just getting this red dice just in case for the gremlin. How many can and you move? Three. Three, but the best way would be one, two, three, because there, if I went this way, it would go one, two, three. Mm -hmm. You so. can always use your power as well. Can you oh, yes. reach? I'm gonna use my power. No, it's only one. Move and hit. Move. Mm -hmm. So you need... Wait, wait I think, so now that I'm there, the gremlin will get me. Right, yeah, but not if you kill him. Yeah, no. Uh, the gremlin. Oh, well, the, the, yeah, yeah, that's what I meant. Well, our gremlin's got a range of two, so you I need... can choose either one, so we can do one on each. I just have four dice. I'm basically from the McShuffins, but powerful. Yeah. <laughs> mm. One on the orc. Well, Thunder McScruggins only did one on me, so it makes sense that if you're the okay. same... Well, that's your go. You're yes, not determined anymore true. either. Um, so you're down to two whites. It's just a red and two whites. Mm -hmm. So enemy turn. McScruggins coming after me again. He's going to be on your tail even though you don't have one. Great. That's fine. So that takes me down to two. You can use your potion. Next I can way. use my potion next round. That's why I'm not too worried. And it's the free action. And I can move twice. It's a free action as well. Yeah. So that orc now is going to attack dwarf twice. <laughs> Two oh, reds for an orc, isn't it? I know, I thought you said that one. Nice roll, that's really good. Right. Two out of that isn't too bad. I would say he should... Wait, how much health do you have? Seven. Okay, the, the gremlin should attack you since I have six. Okay, so the gremlin attack wizard one. And that's once more. Okay. So you're down to five. Going on health here. Uh, yeah, but we're near the end. We only need to get the last story. Uh, right, so everybody done, yeah. So mm -hmm. yeah. I want to read the victory ones. Open up. See yeah. right there. Mm. I think I thought I was uh -huh. going to say it's probably going to be a bunch of orcs. Yeah, you should probably do that since yeah, then it would way, just go way. out. If yeah. you did that, it would go out in the abyss. <laughs> right, which way you can move it? Move and open up again. Yeah, I would say so. This way. Mm. You could just ask us to do it for you instead of standing up. And it's just that, so. Well, that's fine because that just means we're moving through with no extra enemies. You can't can't you explore again? No, because no, she next, needs to be on the other end. end. Yeah, I know. So somebody either needs to go that way or we need to come this way. I would Make say sure Alex these... come. Alex, what? Yeah. Try and destroy Alex. these enemies? I would say Alex try and go up here. Okay. One, two, three. Mm hmm. Because I can shoot that orc. Explore me, boy. Well, the gremlin can't see anyone, so he's Gremlins! And a chest. And you've still got an action left. Is this a... Wait, can't the gre this gremlin hit me? Mm. No. I thought his shot could go here, 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 yeah, here. Yeah, he probably could, actually. Okay, fine. Is that not a... No, that's number, number six, not a letter. Okay. So, are you tacking that gremlin next to you? Yeah. He's not dead. Oh, determined. Mm. Okay. Whoops. So let's have spear woman. Wait, I, can't I? Oh, I can't. Never no. mind. I, I'll, I'll have crossbow dude. I was saying 
in my head, you don't have your power, you don't have your power, you don't have your power, but I say it anyways. Right, let's attack that orc. Orc is dead. Now, actually, on my line of sight, if you go in to that corner, I can see that gremlin. You have your power! power. He's dead. Just saying. If you look, we're almost losing. Well, we've got three turns left, and there's only two of these left. All right, let's go. So Spear Woman is going to do some right. running. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Enemy turns, so Thunder McScruggins. Wait, should I do the Gremlins just right now? Hold on. I'll do Thunder McScruggins first because he's strongest. So he's going to get an attack on Crossbow D. I got the full bite. Nice! Yay. Nothing out of four. Well, that's why Healer Cat is so weak, because she gets to roll two whites to heal something, and it and hardly it ever heals nipple. anything. It barely... Any... I need an extra one. You just need reds for the gremlins. Oh, yeah. I thought you were giving it to me since I got it with my gut. So that's nothing. One damage to you, with two more attacks to go. One more. I am almost one. dead. Well, I'm on, three hill. I'm on two. You should, you should do No, I forgot to use my potion. That's fine. So next round. Can I go? Yeah. You, you need to try and kill these gremlins. Can I use my power? Didn't you don't need to now. Can you move it? Yeah, I don't need yeah, to move it. Yeah, I did that. forget to move that. Well done, remember. You're next to one at the moment, so you can use your power if you kill this one and go after the other one. <laughs> <laughs> no, fine, we'll take that. If it falls off the table, you can roll again. Yeah, and then use your power. You're not determined anymore, though, yeah. so you're going to lose a white die. Bye bye! And then you've got to move, I'd say, down into the corner, down, yeah, into the corridor so you can explore. Yeah, explore. Not yet. Not yet. I'll kill him. Yes, he's dead. He's dead. I thought maybe I shouldn't go because then somebody else could explore and that no, would be in the right. way. Just, just pass just, him up, he's dead. It's a story! Nice. Should I do it like that? You can do it however uh, you want. Well, Wait, I should do it like that since that's the closest to the tap. Right. Yeah. Okay, so flavour text for the last one. There are two goblins in this room. Okay. One is short and fat and the other is tall and thin. <laughs> the short one is opening up doors and emptying their contents into a sack. It looks like he's trying to rob the place. The thin one is over by the sink, dancing around and splashing in the water from the running tap. Marv! The short <laughs> one shouts, stop messing around in the water and help me with the loot. But I like it, Harry, said the thin one. <laughs> Water could be our calling card. We call ourselves the Wet Bandit Goblins. The Wet Bandits. Daddy, They're in you, Home Alone, aren't they? I don't know. If you see, when you, if as Spear Woman, you can go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and oh. then do it. Okay, hold on. Suddenly, the goblins notice you. Harry picks up a nearby mop and waves it menacingly. <laughs> <laughs> well, Marv puts a bucket over it over his head as a helmet. Oh dear! Charge! They shout. I pointed at Alex for the mop because Alex yeah. decided the other day he was going to mop my face <laughs> um, with the mop. Well, and he's the one who opened the room, so he's the one who's been spotted by the goblins. So they would have been waving it at him. So place two goblin standees on any two different yeah. empty squares. I bet they're on the tough side, aren't they? No. No? Oh, a I hero thought... standing on card F can try to turn off the taps. Why not on card F? No, not yet, you're not. And I'm not the one with the plunger. Oh wait, I don't, I don't need the plunger. Okay, so I can potentially end it now then. Yeah, you should just end if it. If you go... Well, I can end it now. You have your power. Anyway. You, you have to go into F, yeah. yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, do it. Well, I'd like to see if we could kill the <laughs> goblins at least. No. Afterwards. Well, no. we've still got Thunder McScruggins over here as well. We don't have to use him, though. We could just run. 
Yeah, the wrench and I'm going to power. Engine. So that's all four taps turned off. Have we won? I believe so. Yeah, so if the heroes turn off all four taps in the dungeon, we have won. Yeah. Wait, you managed to turn off wait, all the taps. I wanted to say I wanted to win the, read the winning one. You want to read the victory yeah. text? Oh, there's a lot of things for the... For the losing. I really want to read the losing bit. Well, read both. Okay. You managed to turn off all the taps and run out of the dungeon before you get into any more trouble. You firmly suggest to Kevin and Animal that they find somewhere else to fill up their water balloons next time. Mm -hmm. Well done, adventurers, you have won the quest. Nice. Now I am going to read if you lose. You limp out of the dungeon just in time as the water rises up and spills out of the entrance. The water flows down the hillside and sweeps through the town of Hoodersfield, catching everyone by surprise as they suddenly find themselves knee deep in muddy dungeon water. You suddenly realise that as your bedroom is downstairs, your bed is going to be soaking wet. You're going to have a very soggy night's sleep tonight. Yeah. You lost the quest, better luck next time. Wow. Thankfully, we don't have a wet bed. We have a nice dry town, and Thunder McScruggins can get back in the bath. Wait, he's he wait, keeps scrubbing they himself. Get us all in the way, and then they continue robbing things, and then he goes back to his bath. Yeah. Well, it would have been mean to kill kill him just because he was having a nice bath. Yeah, it's true, but there. This is rubber ducky. Yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah, we'll oh, no, you do need to use a full action to turn off the tap. Oh, well. Okay, we made it a bit easier for ourselves, but even I so... I told you. I don't think we were in any danger of losing anyway, because we were the... Yeah. Since Wizard Woman was ranked then, she, ha she has a meme of four. One, two, three. Oh, she wouldn't make it. I thought she could make it for some reason. No, but those goblins... You would have kill. done one attack on the dwarf. We wouldn't have needed to really kill him anyway. Uh, but he, could, one of them could get that, and one of them could get that, and then we would lose since I have free health. Well, we could have just put wizard woman in there to take the two attacks, or, uh, yeah. or spear woman in there to take the well, two attacks. But don't you only have two? Oh, yeah, but I got my potion of healing. So if I wasn't going to end the turn there, I would have put myself back up to eight. So it would wait, have been fine. But the you're going to use off the end of that down track or anything. Just reading if how to lose. And Thunder McScruggins might have uh, got an extra attack on me here before I ran away. Yeah, true. Also, but then I'd have run away eight and he wouldn't have got the attack on me there, so that evened out actually. Mm -hmm. So I think, although we ended a turn too soon, it's not a turn that would have ended the game. Oh no, it's fine. I think we got, yeah. It didn't benefit us enough that I think it would have cost changed us, the changed the outcome. So... I think we had the right team. Yeah. So what have we got next? The next one, if I am correct, is with Cat a Two Heads. Cat a Two Heads. Mm. Oh, so we're going to have Penna Luna involved. Yep. It's Remy Luna. Oh, Remy Luna. Yeah. With Penny Orcs, Luna Goblins, part. Gremlins and Spiders. Mm. And to win, we have to turn one two-headed cat back into two one-headed cats. Oh, so we've got to split them in half. And that one's written by Paula Deming from This Game is Broken and Things Get Dicey. So this is like a celebrity scenario next week. And we lose by any of the heroes are defeated. Cool. Mm. Okay. Also, the thing is, this... This thing is actually really one, two, it's really long. three pages. Yeah, so that is a very long one. It's three pages. Lots of flavour text to be read. But yeah, hopefully you'll join us next week for that. Uh, thank you for watching. Look after yourself, stay safe and have a good one. Bye-bye now. Bye. Have a good day.